Hello, so it's been a little while since I came to you and did a video, but I am still doing the, what do they call the crown and glory method? Um, what it is is um, my hair growth method. My hair um, tends to grow when I leave it alone some and braid it up and, you know, just kind of keep it moisturized and stuff, so I'm kind of on that journey because, as I mentioned before, I'm tired of this cycle where I've been, my hair grows and then I get some damage or I cut it or a combination of the two and it's really not fun, you know, um, and I see like the progress of other people, like I was looking at um, May's channel, just Natural Chica, just like a little while ago, and she's at her three year natural anniversary and I'm like, whoa, like, you know, she retains so much length. And also my niece, who, I, who I've who um, i showed you in a previous video, she's retained, you know, her length very well. And me, I've just, like, done a lot of stuff, and and I've cut my hair and stuff, and so I haven't retained the length that I would like to see. Um, but, you know, I have, thank God, progressed from where I was. But um, I could be further along had I taken some other steps, maybe not to process my hair so much by like um, heat styling um, and not cutting it so much. And so right now, um, hopefully I'll just be able to leave it alone for a while, not get it like clipped. If I clip anything, um, it might be like single strand knots, but not getting it like fully clipped for a while. And some people that might sound crazy, but with the way that my hair is and the amount of time it takes for it to progress um, and then like what I experience with my hair might just be best for me right now just to leave it alone um, instead of clipping it and doing things like that. So what I did is I put some long braids in and I haven't worn braids this long very much at all um, <laughs> in my life. Um, for in high school for like two and a half years I wore braids like and that's when my hair grew to its like longest length since I've been older uh, and so I don't know how long I'll wear them for this time but I'm ready to see some progress and I'm ready to stop going through this cycle of growth and cutting and breakage and all this stuff so right now I'm taking some vitamins I can show you which vitamins I'm taking but before I do that, um, the way I'm moisturizing my hair right now is I'm spraying it with water and using this um, Africa's Best Ultimate Herbal Oil. And sometimes, like, if you... the This oil seems to be nice. Let me back up for a little while. This, it seems to, to be um, a little stronger than just putting some oils on your hair. It's a combination of oils. Um, the ingredients are soybean oil, walnut seed, oil, kiwi fruit extract, olive fruit, castor seed oil, sesame oil, jojoba, carrot, sweet almond oil, then it has something called tocopherol acetate, which I'm not sure what that is, safflower oil, calendula extract, yarrow extract, cucumber extract, carrageenan extract, ginseng extract, sage extract, comfrey, and aloe extract and fragrance. So it sounds like it has a lot of, um, natural or herbal or um, plant ingredients in it um, but it's like if you can see it makes makes your skin shiny and, and it's kind of a thicker oil so it, it I don't know it, it might do a little bit more I don't know if you can see it absorbs a little more or or what but this is what I've been using lately. That's what my sister actually said she was using on my niece's hair. Um, even though, you know, she, I don't think she consistently uses it all the time. My niece's hair, you know, I guess with her genetic makeup and everything, her hair grows um, faster or it's, you know, um, stronger. It's a different texture and it's like down her back. Um, but my sister, um, she doesn't do a lot of, you know, a lot of styling and stuff. So her hair isn't being manipulated a whole lot. Um, and I think what I need to do is just kind of back off and be simple with my hair because, you know, I've been complicated <laughs> sometimes, you know, I've tried different products, but sometimes, like May said in her video, I just watched, she did an update, and congratulations on your wedding, by the way, May, God bless you and your husband-to-be, Lord willing, um, but like she said, she found out, like, in her journey, that simple is better for her hair, so... Um, I've actually 
you know, kind of found that to be true in my own journey, like not a bunch of um, heat styling 